Welcome to PC Mac. In today's video, we are going to talk about DitePy and I'm going to show you how we can go ahead and use DitePy desktop. For today's video, I'm going to check LXT version of DitePy desktop. So let's do it. First of all, let's just go ahead and visit the DitePy website. And from here, we just need to move down and you can see DitePy softwares and under desktop section, when we click on it, you can see how many desktops we have. LXTE, LXQT, Mate, XFCE, GNU Setup and Chromium. I believe you all want to install Chromium and go ahead and check it. But for today's video, I'm going to check LXTE and in the next video, we'll check the Chromium, how it work and how the performance is all about. So we'll go ahead and do this one. You can see highly optimized lightweight desktop without the bloatware. If you are seeking a raw performance desktop, LXTE is all you need. One of the lightest and functional desktop available. One of our favorite. So what we need to do, we need to log into our Pi where the Diet Pi is installed. So I have turned on my Pi and let's go ahead and open wireless network watcher to check the device status and uh, let's stop it once and turn it on again. And you can see the Raspberry Pi is available at the address too. Now let's just go ahead and open the PowerShell to connect to the Pi. And the command is SSH and by default we have root at 192.168.1.2 when we hit enter it will ask for the password you need to reset the password when you install DietPy on your machine so let me just put the password in and i'm logged in here and you can see run now to apply 34 available apt package upgrade so always install it we are already on root so we'll skip sudo and it will start installing all the upgrades and then we will start installing the LXDE version of the desktop. Now Pi upgraded to the latest version. What do we need to do? We need to type diet Pi softwares and we will see this screen from here you need to use browse softwares if you know the name of the software use search software otherwise select browse software and from here you can see LXD ultra lightweight desktop just press the space bar to select and then the tab button to select ok and press enter once we do that the operating system is select to install what do we need to do we just need to move down and press the tab key again to select ok and hit enter and let's select OK and it will start downloading and installing the LXTE version of desktop on our Diet Pi. Once the installation complete, it will restart the machine and then we can start using our desktop version. Now the problem here is that Diet Pi consists of lots of software so how we can go ahead and use it we need to use a command that will enable it for us to access this operating system through our Raspberry Pi and to use the LXC version of desktop the command that we need to use is start X and if we want our Pi to boot directly into the desktop so we just need to use diet Pi auto start and select the desktop software so just wait until this software install then we will go ahead and check how this particular operating system perform Now you can see, would you like to configure the Diet Pi Auto Start option? This will allow you to choose pro which program load automatically after the system has booted up. It says console, desktop or coding. So I, I can either select OK or cancel. So we'll just go ahead and click cancel. Now once the installation complete, we will reboot the Pi and then we can start the operating system from here. Now let me just open uh, the Pi and show you what is going on. Let me reboot it from here and then we will take you to the Pi and show you. Now you can see the Raspberry Pi screen and what we need to do here, we just need to start the command on the PowerShell. So I need to just use the same commands, ssh root at 192.168.1.2 
and then the password now we just need to type start x and hit enter once we do that you will see the desktop will change to lxte version now you can see there are minimum things installed and let's just try to open chromium and i'm using a 2gb version of raspberry pi 4b so it's working so you can try it at your end and try to install use it so this is it for today so we have installed lxt desktop on diet pi if you like our work please hit the like button subscribe to our channel and press the bell notification for our latest video share this video with your family and friends thank you for watching bye bye take care have a nice day